Good kitten internet. Uh, once more, I am Aetherspoon, and this is my Let's Play Sid Meier's Alien Crossfire with Thinker Mod. And I'm Creative. Mm -hmm. Joining me on audio, as usual, is my lovely partner. Uh, let's get back to it. Um, one thing I'm going to note right away is that as eagle-eyed viewers may note that I am loading up a 2201A save. The reason for that is that I made one minor change, or I should say editor me made one minor change. Um, and that is to actually label this one tile with the phrase raise me, because I keep seeing it in editing and I keep forgetting it when I'm playing. That's the only difference between that and when we last left off. Um, speaking of, um, we have updated ThinkerMod to the latest version. Um, if you hit Alt-T when you're running ThinkerMod, you can actually see the ThinkerMod options here. Uh, so our build is from the 15th of December. Today is the 15th of January, and this is the most recent build I've checked this morning. Um, we have played this for just about five hours, given that this is the start of the sixth video, I think. That sounds about right. Um, we can also see statistics, things like the total number of bases in the game and the fact that I have 20 of the 109 bases in the game. That makes me sad. <laughs> But I think I have, yeah, I, it looks like I have a significantly higher percentage of the population. Oh, well. Anyway, I just found that this was interesting, and I'm going to try to remember to do this at the start of every video. Just as a brief catch-up. Uh, looks like we were last researching Dr. Nairpower. Mm, yes. How far are we? Five more years. That's not too bad. Let's go. Ah, oh, crap. Of all the places to get Planet Blight, you demanifold, really? Dang it, me. Oh. Usually I'm good about having biology labs, but I've been too busy expanding. Mm -hmm. Well, you're definitely getting more homers now. Oh, that's right. I'm prototyping missiles. I remember now. All right. That was a notification noise. Let's just make sure it's not anything I have to care about. Nope. Okay. And yeah, I am now losing food like crazy because I lost all of my farms and forest. Luckily, it's going to take a very long time for it to actually run out of food. So I'm Yeah, you have a good stockpile. Yeah. Alright. We got another probe team. I think I'm just going to start making more formers in general. Actually, you should have sea formers. Ah, destroyer probe team. Nice. I want you to make a colony pod because editor me finally remembered what in the world I was doing. Where's my colony pod? I'm blind. Forgot. Uh, so I was playing as a human faction yesterday. Yeah. And it's just like, where, where'd they go? They look so different. Yes. It's only the infantry version. If you do a rover colony pod, it'll not the like that. Mm -hmm. Although all of the formers look different. I don't know if you noticed, um, progenitor formers are red, everybody else's formers are yellow. Yeah. yeah I've noticed. Mm -hmm. I guess it is kind of obvious. Especially with how many I have. Okay, you can stop with the colony pods for now. You know what? Maybe we do need some bio labs. Mm -hmm. Just maybe. Oh, Fanari is so happy. Oh, I can hear the purrs, which means they can hear the purrs. Um, Fanari is creator, one of Creator's cats, for reference. He's sitting on my lap and purring almost straight into the microphone. Which is why we can hear it. Ah, we finished building that borehole. 
guess technically we want a crawler here first. All right, group team. I mean, if I'm going to invade, this would be a good spot to start invading at. It's close to Demanifold. And it's actually yeah. a reasonable city spot, too. Other than the proximity to Invictus. Alright. Forest. <laughs> yeah, I think Unity landing spots are almost always arid for some reason. Yeah, I've never seen it be anything but arid or covered in forest if someone opened the a pod there a long time ago. Mm -hmm. I've seen it not be arid, but it's due to other reasons. Like, um, what was it? Uh, some other, oh, right, um, an earthquake. Mm. Earthquake would hit and then it would no longer be arid because... An earthquake hit. And it will adjust rainfall based off of rain shadows and so on. Still the only game I've ever played that does something like that. Alright, destroyer probe team. Oh, hello, Sea Lurk. Goodbye, Sea Lurk. I've never ran into a sea lurk in a non-fungus square before. Yeah, that... I think that I've seen... I've had that happen before, but I was the cause of the sea lurk. I've never I seen think... it where I didn't cause I it. I mean, sea lurks are technically submarines, aren't they? Yes. yes so you wouldn't see them until you run into them. Mm-hmm. Oh, and I was looking through the... Um, patch notes for the unofficial patch today and I found out that there was a bug with sea lurks in the original release mm -hmm. they had the same movement penalties in fungus as normal units oh no <laughs> <laughs> it's like I can see that being a problem okay you have a real garrison now which means that I can move you back somewhere So what I wanted to do with this destroyer transport was to actually send a colony pod over to here. Obviously, it's a little too late for that now. Because I wanted to build a base there. That's it would have been perfect. I know. But two, three, yeah. four. Plus oh. volcano terrain gives bonus oh. energy and mineral. If you manage to take out Kyron uh, Stigmata, it's size one, so if you destroy yeah. it quickly, it should go away. But I'd need an invasion force. And I don't really have that right now. You're. Yeah, it's probably going to grow before you have air power. Yes. It's a very Although, green maybe area. Not. Ah! It Hello, you can just pull it, pull it out after you take it. It'll be size one again. Right. I have Foreman Demaya of the drones on channel three. Shall I put him through? Um. Yeah, let's talk to him. Yeah. So, you must be Guardian Himini. I, Foreman Demaya of the drones, offer greetings. Words of your accomplishments have spread since the time of your landing. You may be aware that I plan to free the enslaved working classes from their oppressors. Do not attempt to interfere. Yep. Foreman Domai is the union leader. Yep. Ooh. Pretend friendship with Svensgard. Oh, I am so tempted to accept this. Because, one, the pirates hate me anyway. Yeah. And, two... Getting a Pact of Brotherhood with the drones sounds like a great idea. They're actually doing fairly well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, screw it. It's not like I'm currently at peace with them or anything. It's an informal truce, which means that I can yep. violate it without any penalty. 
All right. And now I get their massive map, which I will be exploring in a bit. Okay. The data angels have declared war on me. I haven't even met them yet. <laughs> Guessing she has a pact with the pirates? Yeah. I remember that from last time. Um, can we trade research? Oh, they're behind, which is not unexpected because they have a 20% research penalty. But unlike the believers who have the same research penalty, they're not idiots and actually can run things other than fundamentalism. Um... Okay, let's take a look at their area. Okay. They definitely share territory with the usurpers. That means that the usurpers go from here all the way over to here. I think I'm starting to see why they're so high up on the dominance chart. Because that's a lot of territory. All right, they're running 20% psych already. I mean, it's pretty close to the time that I should be doing that, but lots of boreholes. Borehole, borehole, borehole. That's not a lot of boreholes. It's just the oh, yeah, small I guess it's amount just three. of boreholes. I mean, I think I have more than that. All right, so I will not, in fact, be throwing a base up here. <laughs> I think over here instead. Yeah. I mean, I'm at war with over half the planet. Yep. But hey, we can meet Cinder Rose now. Ah, the insightful guardian Himini. I've heard many tales of your exploits, says to myself. I remain Data Jack Rose of the Angels. My intention is to open the floodgates, barring access to information. Might is wanting. She is not doing well against the usurpers. She has a plasma garrison prototype. How is she even alive? I mean, I'm fine with blood truce with the data angels. I have no intention of fighting them. Guardian Himini, we feel a strange kindred spirit, both of us being outcast and mistrust by others on planet. Not only that, but we admire jazzy neck flaps. A treaty of friendship would be suitably chic, don't you agree? I think that... Cinder Rose has unique dialogue with just the Guardian. And no other faction leader. Hmm. Because I seem to remember that, like, this is not something that could be phrased with a Mad Lib style of response, which is the way everybody else's interactions are. <laughs> not to understand, Jazzy. Treaty anyway. Agreement. Splendid. My covert operations and your grand experiment complement each other nicely. Like, this is a Mad Lib style thing. If you look at the files, it's always Splendid, my blah, and your blah complement each other nicely. Mm. And of course, she prefers democracy, so she's going to be happy with me. Um, let's see. I would like some research. Oh, she's not willing to sell her map. I was really hoping for that. Secrets of the human brain for a packed sibling? I think that's worth it. Mm hmm. Although, information classified, emotion, mock sorrow. <laughs> sure. I would have traded Secrets of the Human Brain for a map. Which this gets me. Alright, so let's see how bad the... Ooh. Yeah. She lost three bases to the Progenitor. And it looks like she might be... No? There's no enemy units nearby. 
least none that. And that's that's Kenova. a size four base. So yeah, with no garrison, that is probably that the progenitors took out the garrison. So that base is starving. Let's let's take a look. Um. Yep, she is under attack. She has a single scout patrol guarding Moonshadow. Green scout control. And look at her mineral usage. Yeah. So Ugh. many garrison, and none of them are in that space. She is having a really rough time. On the other hand, none of the drone named bases are over here. So that means that the drones have not actually been attacked by the usurpers yet, or at least not successfully. Yeah, it looks like, I mean, obviously the usurpers have been expanding westward and. Mm -hmm. Well, we're not actually sure yeah. where their capital is. Yeah, we are. We are. Aren't we? No, we're not. No. So, hmm. we don't know what direction they started expanding in. Right. Anyway. Anyway. We have new allies and a new enemy. Yep. So, the pirates are the ones closest to us, so we should probably focus on dealing with those. And your theory was right. You were wondering if we could upgrade to a transport foil without any change. And the answer is no, we can't. But put that. trans on it, then you can. Yeah, but that actually costs a decent amount. Well, mm -hmm. that's not that bad, I guess. At that point, you might as well... Though. Yeah. And then trans is free, isn't it? Grade. 80 credits, that's worth it. And now it's the correct color. God damn it, that was a rocky trial again. I hate not being able to tell when something's rocky underneath the monsoon jungle. I would, I would head over to get repaired at the upgrade monolith. Yep, now I'm going to. Okay, it is in fact the cyborgs. I mean, there's nobody left that it couldn't be because we've, yeah. All seven factions are now accounted for. The six here plus me. You actually, okay, you have gotten to the monolith. Just need to find out. Ooh, my territory almost meets. Yeah. <laughs> almost. All right. Colony pod. Now that I know that they're just right there. This would actually overlap by one tile with them, but only one tile. And Acceptable. that's a really good base site in my mind. Yeah, it is. Oh yeah. I'm at war with them now. Combat support. Nom. Maybe you can steal a tech from them? I can't reach it because of the fungus. Yeah. Oh, no, I can. I just have to go to Cape Town. Mm. 
Ooh, we estimate the current infiltration will expire in 26 turns. Mm -hmm. That is That's something new. that the most recent patch added. I have their world map, which means they don't have any tech. And the probe team got compromised from that. Oh, oh well, I do need the map, and they actually have a decent area. Ooh, geothermal shadow, shallows, nice. Okay, now the real fun part. This unit is surrounded by enemy forces. <laughs> mm-hmm. And zone of control means that I can't really... Oh, zone of control no, that's doesn't, right, doesn't matter in for... water. Yeah. yeah. So can I get this unit out of there? Because I don't think I have good odds. Yeah, I can't really fight my way out very easily. I can go up, I guess. Hmm. Also, phone made noise, and that is... Okay, don't need to worry about that. I'm going to be within a base radius no matter where I go, which means that they're going to go after me. So that is the only spot I can go that would not be in a base radius. Looks like the edge of their territory. Um, you're independent. You're going off this way. Hmm. Cult farm. The only downside with using Isles of the Deep is that their visibility range is garbage. 200 credits? Thank you. And another 50. Okay. You are just going I'm to just, sleep in fungus. Yeah, <laughs> sleep in fungus. Yep. Alright. There's nothing this way because there's actually a land bridge to covering up the southern ocean. So we are going this way. I did not mean to try to have my unit land. That one is a little damaged. Oh, I didn't even notice. Oh, is it 20%? Yep. Yeah, I normally don't bother healing at 20%. Turn you complete. need food. Okay, I have money. Is there something that I should be buying? Something that editor me remembered. This is set for former and not C former. And this is something that I should buy. Because it's going to take for freaking ever otherwise. Why is it getting one food from fungus when it could get three food and a mineral and energy from... Good yeah. question. Well, that was a really <laughs> short alliance of theirs. And they lost Moonshadow, as I expected. Maximum population reached. I don't have an air unit nearby. I only have one movement point. I can't get away. Yeah. And you have no navy. Correct. It's great. And your unity scout chopper isn't in range. No, it's not. My Unity Scout Chopper is all the way over here right now. I believe it's in Great Intertwining? Yep. So, not even close. And it's, and it's also damaged. Yes. So it wouldn't win the fight anyway. Uh, what do I want to do? Probably Infiltrate. Yeah. Okay, we have 27 turns at the moment. Estimated. Mm-hmm. Good, it finally leveled up. I needed one of them to level up already. <laughs> oh. Are you... One more turn. Okay. Engaging 
Vietnam. I really need to get a former over there, raise the terrain so I can invade. That poor tile, you can't even tell what's on it anymore. You need sleep. Uh, the blinking units is starting to annoy me a bit. Really? Yeah. Is it... A... What do you mean? The unit's blinking. Okay. I mean, I think I can theoretically turn that off, but then I won't be able to know what unit's active. I can either turn on or off pull unit blinks. Like that. That's it. Oh, that's much better. It was already off, so I don't know why it wasn't working. But it was blinking the whole time. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm not saying it wasn't. I'm just saying I don't know why it wasn't. Okay, that was a victory even though I didn't see it. <laughs> Stupid sonar pod. Stupid sonar pod. That one I would reload on. Getting two sonar pods on the same turn. Sure. I'll take the help. Sure. I'll let it heal. This is not going to be doing anything for a while anyway. Oh, I still want a canal base there. Yeah, but there's a base. Yep, it's in base radius. you have a so. lot of overlap with. Yep, that would be where the base is. Um... That is a rocky tile, isn't it? Yes, it is. There. Really? No. That's being a reload. Just fine. I'll take money, but don't do that garbage. Okay. Um, I can take this unit and start scouting over here, I guess, but there's a very high chance I'm just going to get blown up. Yeah, but what else are you going to use it for? That's a fair point. Not until I get air power. Then I can use it for lots of things. Turn complete. Okay. Anything you want to hurry? That's what I was just looking at. That's finishing next turn. That's finishing next turn. I could make that finish next turn. Well, not really. Unless, where's my... I thought I was prototyping the missile unit somewhere. Hmm. I definitely have Maybe... the prototype. Maybe I just forgot to do it. You just made the prototype and forgot to actually build it. Sounds like something I would do. Oh, 
I'll just do that another turn then. I can see that this is the base that I'm currently contemplating building a hab complex. Although I don't know why. I don't have enough food. Now I do. <laughs> Foreman Demai has declared vendetta on the pirates, but that's the reason why. Uh, mm, <laughs> game. Yeah. Um. Now we're a double Ooh. Fin Ooh. Well, I had been wondering how they were surviving. I think my answer is they're not. Yep, and I lost that former as expected. Might as well start building that research lab. Production complete. A sea military unit, maybe? To yeah. take care of the sea, sea lurk? It'd be nicer if I just had the air power at this point, but I still have another couple of turns. I don't have any sea military units. Oh, I guess the missile skimship. And that'll finish prototyping things anyway. You still need to prototype um, the needle jet chassis. Yeah, I know. Oh, thought seed is going to have problems. And considering it's a Psy unit you're up against, it doesn't matter what weapon you have, so... Yeah. Maybe build but, a cheaper ship ship instead? I mean, the unit's going to end up attacking Star Harmony. So the unit itself won't actually be around by the time that the ship would be constructed anyway. Mm. I think. That's a good point. Well, let's see how cheap I can get a unit out there. Maybe I can just buy it, and then I might be able to. Preach. Or Kresh, as it's supposed to be pronounced, and I always call it Kreich for some reason. Um, why are you so low on food? Because I have very little in the way of food producing things at the moment. I know I'm currently working on one of these tiles for a farm, so maybe I need a sea former here. And then afterward, go ahead and queue up few things. Okay. Um. Yay! I can finally build the base! Conservator's Mantle. Is that one of the default ones? Yes. Okay. I don't know why. We haven't seen any of the randomized ones this game so far. That is still an okay consist to start, I think. No, I think I actually want to throw in a Kraish. I know why I didn't before. It's because I was running planned, and that was how I was throttling whether I was pop-booming or not. But let's actually update the consist. Yeah. And the next time I'll update it is when I have police units. Because then I want to have a police garrison thrown in. Okay. Um, go there. Where the heck am I putting you? This border is pretty much secure at this point. I don't need to worry as much there. I should probably be building over here. Oh. 
Well, you have your future base landmark there. Yeah. In Fungus. That I do. Oh, I know what I'm going to do with that. I'm going to put it there. Okay. Um, I wanted to see how cheap I can get a unit. Foil and weapon. 18. Yeah, I think I can just buy that here. Yeah, cost 26. I think that's worth it. Even if the unit ends up just destroying itself. I'm also going to keep the probe team behind for a bit. I don't have a road between these two bases yet. Oh well, I'm just going to sit tight. Run. run? How about road, not run me? It's dumb, but I'm going to extract one nutrient so it doesn't starve. Right, you've got your forest. Upgrade Mala. Artillery! Woo! I actually used artillery. Are you kidding me? Oh. You that don't means get I can't to... build my base there. Yeah. Well, it's possible that's they may just... just lose the base, but yeah, that's just a really dumb spot. Yeah. Oh, hello, cultists. Goodbye, cultists. Rolling rainy minerals bonus. Ah. Uh. So if I mine it, it'll get five minerals, and I'll get two nutrients with a farm. Alternately, I can farm solar. It would be worth three nutrients, three minerals, two energy. I think farm solar actually makes more sense in this case. Oh, hello, new unit of mine. Let me guess, you are... Yep, you are actually home hearth. Do you have enough minerals to support that? Yes, although not by much. Mm. Wait. Just make mine sure forms you... don't take minerals when they're in an Isle of the Deep? Oh? So the Isle of the Deep's definitely not in fungus right now. I don't know. I don't think I've ever noticed that. Sorry, you were um, saying... The mine worms are on that Isle of the Deep? Oh, no. They're on this Isle of the Deep. I forgot. Because I took it and then moved. Ah. Uh, that makes more okay. sense. Okay. In fact, let's confirm this. Okay, yep. That's yep. correct. More money. I have too many Isles of the Deep in this region. I need them elsewhere. Numb? Numb? Numb. Yay, boil status. That means they can hold more people. Uh, an Isle of the Deep that you didn't capture. That's a rarity in this game. Yes. Oh, jeez. Mmm. 
That looks delicious for some crawlers. Yeah. For a base. <laughs> Speaking of... <laughs> <sighs> pirates are on this aisle. Why are pirates here? I don't know. Might as well. <laughs> yep. I am not going to have an ally soon enough. Aha! Uh -huh, the gunfoil did arrive before they had a chance to do anything. Alright, go back to your sea former. Really wish I had clean units right now. You need food badly. Because you have a tile that doesn't produce any food. Yep. But of course, if I move away from that tile, then I have no minerals to speak of. So I'm going to go like yeah. that for a little bit. Let it grow. Num. Num. Uh, wait. Board transport. Not the probe team. The gunfoil. And I captured the sea lurk. Okay. I guess I got a sea lurk. Not exactly what I wanted. Uh, but sea lurks can attack coastal bases. That's right. You did figure that out. That's actually extremely useful. Because I have yeah. a coastal base I need to take on. Never mind. This is great. <laughs> uh, how are they? Post for growth. They're going to expand turns. before I get a chance to do anything. Mm. Not to mention they actually have a healthy garrison. Someday I will actually take on that poor mindworm that's not doing anything. Probably capture it. Yeah. Stop attacking my damn city. Okay, there isn't anything else in there. So, I guess you're going to go all the way around here. Ah, did you finish building a network node? Yes, it did. Our scientists have linked the no library nodule artifact to the data network and regained valuable technology. There are two kinds of scientific progress. I mean, I do need it at some point. Experimentation and categorization, which gradually it's not exactly what I would have chosen. And I don't feel like... Um, it's coming? Yeah, I don't feel like saves coming for that. It would have been nice to get air power, but I'm going to get that in one turn anyway. So. Yeah. So. Unit mass required to allocate. What do you have in there anyway? It's just that stupid skim ship. Uh, 
Okay, well, this unit, I'm not moving there anymore. Hit the wrong button. Um, How about that river right next to the mine worms? That one? Yeah, that's a good spot. Yeah. And I need to make sure that I cover this area before somebody gets the wrong idea. You're sleeping. You're independent, so... Uh, nope. Maybe I should just keep them over here to constantly harvest more and more Isles of the Deep. Yeah. You're going to go... Probably over by the Borehole Cluster would be ideal, but that's going to take a while to get over there. So I think I'm going to just set over on, sit over on future base for a bit. Because I do have a former that's right nearby that can help with that. Okay, that's the one that's dependent on yep. the base. Which is why it's going up here. I'm thinking about just letting it sleep there, actually. Yeah, you know what, that's fine. That's less fine. Money. Yeah, bastards took my damn pod. Targets of opportunity. Yay! Hmm. I don't need Centauri Meditation. I don't need to build Isles of the Deep. I harvest them naturally. Yeah. Um. The fact that I still don't have deloyalty is a little weird. Unfortunately, intellectual integrity, I think, is what's required for getting clean units, isn't it? Or no, that's for police units. It might be yeah. time for me to pick up some of the older ones. Although, narrow grafting would be really nice. It is. So then I can yeah, for bioengineering is the one with clean reactor, isn't it? Yeah, you're right. It is. So... I'm still hoping to be able to trade for de-loyalty. The fact that nobody else has it is a little weird. More forms. Oh, no, I'm not coastal. Yeah, but... Although, transfer of help... not a bad idea. Help defense... Defend against mine worms yeah. and such. Your supply crawler. You need more food. We're going to give you more formers. Okay. I now have a scout chopper that is ready to move. Uh, I would die. Probably, yeah. I'm just going to keep it over in Manifold 6th for a bit. Where am I putting you?
just gonna keep the gun foil sleeping in there. Hmm. How much money do they have? I'm not expecting much, but 441, it's actually more than I was expecting. I mean, it's that or sabotage, but sabotage, all that's going to do is halt their recycling tanks. Yeah. At least I think so. Let me double check. Yeah, all it does is halt recycling tanks. That's not worth it. Especially since I lost. Um, drain energy. Mission 12 and a level up. That's worth it. You're the one that are holding those. finally doing that, and I am going to disband the other one. That helped some. Oh, right. We have fair power. You're doing a missile squad. Oh, you're going to be doing other things. Ah, all my good bases are doing stuff, aren't they? Maybe instead of the probe team, I should actually be building the gun needle jet here. Because that's actually closer to where I need it. Make it a empath gun needle jet, and then you can take out the fungal towers. True. Okay, that was just a pod, like I thought. Cool. The crude human pod is malfunctioning and unleashed an earthquake. Typical. Although I'm actually thinking that's not a bad earthquake. Yeah, I think that's beneficial. You're yeah, still so coastal. Too. Yep, I'm still coastal. And there's now fewer sea tiles, which is generally better. Yeah, actually, I think I gotta keep that. It. Oh, I was hoping to be able to capture oh. it. I can't. Because if I can capture it, then it might have had mind worms in it, and then I could actually invade. <laughs> that is quite unfortunate. Your new unit is very green. Yep. I have minus two morale penalty. Because of wealth. Yep. It's because of wealth.
And until I get um, knowledge, I'm going to be running wealth. It doesn't make sense for me to run anything else. Right there, tidal harness. There. Okay, now that I have two, we're going to go over this way and start building colonies. Ideally, I would have also thrown in a mind worm, but that mind worm was busy. Okay. Um, crap, you have a mind worm garrison now in there. That's going to be too much for that poor sea lurk to take on, I think. I don't know. Attacker has advantage. Unless if it's sea. Or is it just air that the attacker no longer has an advantage? It's one of those two. I thought that was just Psy Combat. Nope. It um, The default Psy rating of either C or Air units is 1 instead of 3 or 2. Hmm. It's a really weird set of things. Um, I don't have any... Yeah, the only thing I can build is, pro, er, is um, Empath Guild, which I don't particularly need. Um, anything that I should hurry... I could hurry the research hospital. Yeah, I still don't have anything above seven pop. Nope. I think it's next turn. Ooh. And they lost another base. Um, the angels aren't going to have land bases. They just lost three bases in one turn. That's painful. All right, we've prototyped missiles now. That's good, at least. That unit, I want that one upgraded. Upgrade. 240, I have the money. That should be a little better. And out of curiosity, my other options aren't all that great either, so. Okay. Just going to actually connect these. All right, let's see what the odds are like. Okay, so attacker does still have advantage on seaside combat, at least. Although I don't know if this counts as sea or not. <laughs> huh, I just noticed. Oh, no, that's right. It wouldn't matter for this. You don't get the planet bonus if you're using a non-native unit. Ah, that's where their unit went. Um... What do you have in there? Oh, it's just a scout patrol. I don't care. Be nice if I didn't have so many green units. Stupid morale penalty. I'm at war with four different people and I'm still running wealth. Uh, this will be the last turn, by the way. We've hit an hour. 
I'm getting really tired. I can tell. You've started becoming quiet again. I think I need a nap. Nap sounds lovely. Yep. It is C versus C. Look at it. It's Psi 1, Psi 1. Mm. The only reason why it's 3 to 2 odds is because I have a nice planet rating. And apparently planet itself doesn't count as having a planet rating. Yeah, that's... <laughs> mm. I mean, I guess otherwise it wouldn't be balanced at all. Soon, my little Unity Scout Chopper. Soon I will be able to upgrade you to anything else. I'm not trying to keep it alive. I keep going after towers and succeeding. That one's actually roughly even odds. I lost. So close, though. I'll just reload. Might as well just keep the cow chopper but yes it was really close this isn't the unit that i wanted to move for that but i might do that anyway Didn't even know that unit was there. No, 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 no. You are going to operate that tile and give me minerals. Much better. Honestly, I don't even need the sea former. More colony pod. <laughs> when in doubt. You should probably build an aerospace complex in a base where you intend to build air units. Yeah, that is a good point. I mean, the base that I'm intending to build air units is actually this one. The one that's building the prototype right now. Because it's actually my highest mineral base at the moment. Okay. And it's also close by to everything I want to use air units on. Sure, we'll queue that up. Because I will forget before next time, as usual. Imagine if there wasn't a queue function. <laughs> that would be terrible. That would be Civ 1. And Civ 2, mm. if I remember right. If you had removed the fungus of the tile one over, you could have gotten a sea mineral. Oh yeah, you're right. Oh well. It's not that big of a deal, I suppose. You can send a supply skimship over to crawl it. Yeah. Although I hardly um, ever bother with supply Yeah, ships. because sea lurks and all of the deep. And... Yeah, they're not safe. I hear my housemate returning. Should find a fungus square yep. to hang out in. That's why I was just trying to see what the closest fungus square that I can reach would be. I'm just gonna keep it there, basically. Of course. We are going to start the money patrol. Had to happen at some point. Um, let's see. Money? No. How 
about with a friend. That does zero damage. Yeah, worked. I'm just slowly moving that colony pod in the hopes that this base gets taken. Yeah. Just an impact rover. All right. Let's make sure that there isn't anything else that we want to do before saving and exiting. Uh, actually. There we go. Because this won't finish in time, so I might as well have it make the unit I actually want. Yeah. Um, your production is awful, but that's probably okay, I guess. It's about to grow. Yeah, it's about to grow. I was just thinking if I should just hurry it. Yeah, I think I am going to hurry it. It's only 94. I have plenty of money. And I think that will be it. Hope you've yep. enjoyed this internet. And I hope you've enjoyed this, creator. I have, but now I'm so tired. Then take a nap. Then fire Z missiles! Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Okay. Mm. Bye. Bye.